the climate exhibit back in May of 2007 when I came here with my family and we got to see it for the first time. <laughs> I like the photographs at first because of the shock of the changing climates and uh, you know two different pictures contrasted 60 years apart it was really uh, eye-opening and then it kind of led you into this exhibit which is nice. I think it's very educational but at the same time very interactive. My little sisters are four years old and they were playing with you know the carbon footprint stuff and like feeling the windows and seeing which one was was retaining the heat so that was really cool. It's, it's neat to learn and you learn better when you can do. I thought it was uh, really informative, uh, pretty cool. There's a lot of hands-on and a lot of eye-catching things that really make you want to want to engage with it. Once you get in here, you think it's like a science museum or something, not an aquarium. The, the pros and cons of each like alternative energy source and stuff. I learned about like the cons. I didn't know a lot of the cons and made me kind of think about it. I mean, just to see like the coral, the bleached coral as opposed to the healthy coral, it was really eye-opening. I really like the part where you have to turn the light bulbs and see the difference between the incandescent and fluorescent bulbs, because I've heard about how much less energy the fluorescent bulbs take, but to actually turn it and see for yourself, I thought was really entertaining. There's a lot of stuff that the kids can get really you know, hands-on with and active and learn at the same time. I was, I was really impressed with this exhibit because the first time I came through I was more excited to go look at the climate change exhibit and so actually having gone through and read all the information I'm just amazed by how informative it is with all the videos and everything. So it's something you don't want to just walk through, you really want to get have half an hour, 45 minutes to actually read everything because all of it's really informative. The first thing I said when I was walking away is, okay, I have to um, try to like reduce my carbon footprint. And I told my mom, you have to try to reduce your carbon footprint. So it's getting awareness out, which is important. I describe it as an experience for the senses with the different videos, things that you can touch and read that teach you everything about climate change, from how it affects the small fossils and the little shelled animals, all the way to our atmosphere and the weather patterns. I thought it was going to be just about the ocean, but it has stuff about like the entire world. It's pretty important to have this kind of exhibit. I think it would be very interesting for people to at least come and see whether they believe in it or not.